All right, guys, morning. Let me get my toast out. Oh, it's a little bit brown, that one. That's all right. So, heading off on a short day trip this morning. Just to Silistra in Bulgaria and back, just to show everyone how easy it is to get to Bulgaria from Romania, how quick it is. So just a day trip, drive across into Bulgaria, go down to Silistra, put the car on the boat and come back on the ferry boat. So we'll go a beautiful day today so far. It's now 07, expecting to meet Luciano at 7.30. Um, so I nearly burnt my toast, but time to make my coffee. So I just got my little Nescafe Dolce Gusto, went straight into coffee, and then having one of life's little pleasures, which is uh, tomato and cheese on toast. I normally put the tomato on the bread, and then the cheese, and just put it in the microwave to melt the cheese on top of the toast. I'm perfect. All right, catch up shortly, guys. All right, guys, beautiful day today. Looks like it. Get ready to head off to Bulgaria for the day. Lucian waiting over there near his taxi. Yeah, nice day so far. Bit of a breeze about, which is cool. Hey, mate. Bona diminazzo. How are you, mate? Good. All right, guys. So we're just going to get ready and head off on a little day trip. Show you how easy it is to get to Bulgaria and come back again. Not even recording. Oh guys, I just spent five minutes talking to you, everybody, and it wasn't even recording, so... Alright, so we're on our way now to Bulgaria via Rusa, the border crossing. Um, that's just south of uh, Bucharest. Um, it's been in some other videos. But I just want to give you guys an idea of how quick it is to get to Bulgaria. So you can go have a day trip if you want, come back. <laughs> little bit of uh, crazy music going on in the morning so just going to refuel because we've got half a tank so and uh, yeah sort of record a bit in the traffic so you get to see see what the traffic looks like early in the morning and this is um yeah this crossing here is always crazy because it's like a couple of lanes merge into two and So this is the local, uh, my local station anyway. Alright man, we'll put some, mate do you mind doing the honours, it's okay? some old uh, Bulgarian money too so if this time they say hey you can't pay in so yeah we have your money it's all right today yeah remember when we came back last time it was only briefly but we stopped just in the border and bought that bought some stuff So guys, anyone watching, you'll see one of our trams come past on the left. Um, so that's been 
it's an older style but it's been repainted we're getting the new new trams are coming in this year apparently but I saw some of them in Poland last week the same style we're getting but the crazy thing is we get these nice new trams but the tracks are not the tracks haven't been fixed you know so for me fix the tracks first and then get the new trams I never use it much mate so I keep thinking about that um Siguranza, you know for the for the car the insurance oh, sorry a Sigurata yeah because you know I'm so used to the old paper one and I forget it's on the phone now you know normally busy here mm, not that busy this hour like mm. eight yeah we'll be busy coming yeah guys watching I hope there's not too much noise I'm just uh, driving with the window open early morning fresh air because man it's gonna get warm it's gonna get warm this week forecast uh, they said canicula starting end of the week yeah mm. Spain Spain she already have mate uh, Arthur's edge eh, <laughs> no fuck that 40 degrees already with all that fires and everything that's like Australia man yesterday I was talking to one of the clients the young girl mm -hmm. she, she just came back from Bali in Indonesia you know she went for a holiday um, and she said oh I wish I could get on the plane and go back it was so nice and warm and I said what how how was it she said oh the other day was 38 I said oh no <laughs> 38 but she said yeah when you're lying right next to the swimming pool though and it's right there and you can jump in when you're hot 38 is not a problem <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. I think he's good. Yeah, no, she's right. So from here, I'll just let the camera run because um, you'll get an idea then, a real idea of how long it is to the border. It's actually not that far, it's about an hour, hour, 20 minutes, hour and a half from Bucharest. So. And what's today mate, Wednesday? Yeah, hopefully Rousseau, the border crossing is not too busy today. find Russo is always it's like 50 50 some days you get there it's just fucking terrible other days it's straight through yeah. maybe we'll come back to Silistra and everyone has the same idea we get to Silistra and go oh fuck really 50 cars waiting to go in the ferry boat Ah, okay. The Bulgarian uh, side. She wants to repair the bridge. Ah, the big bridge at Rusay, you mean? Yeah. Yeah, the, the bridge yep. crossing the Danube. Yep. She starts now when vacation time. though because mate next year uh, in May from May next year Bulgaria will be oh mate you might have to though from May next year Bulgaria will join Schengen so from May if Romania is still not in Schengen then you'll need a passport you, the ID won't be good enough to get into Bulgaria from May next year everyone will have to have a passport I, I want to go <laughs> yeah. August
radar the other day, saying that crazy guy, crazy man. He said, I, I'm trying to find him at the moment because I have some food and things to give to him. Because we didn't see him for a long time because he fell off a ladder or something. And I said, yeah. yeah. I said, yeah, I know. And I said, guess who's right there? Because he can't see, his eyes are bad, you know. Yeah, yeah. So I said, well, guess who's waiting for you right there? He'll be so pleased to see you. He's already watching you. <laughs> He said, oh, he's there at the door. I said, yeah, he's just near the door. He's waiting for you. He's waiting for you to come and say hello. She told me his name, but I forgot the name. Ah, really? Yeah. Does he tell you anything else about him? Like, is he really, is he really ex-military or is he bullshit, full of shit? Or? No, she told me she had mental problems. <laughs> I don't know, to me, he's always speaking a, a different language. And, um, he's always asking about this. It's a fucking word he always uses. Um, it's like he's always asking for a contribution, but it's not asking for money. It's like doing it in a roundabout way, you know? It's like, yeah, yeah. Um, it's one word he always uses. Like along here. Yeah, normally it is. Uh, 
road, so maybe it's a good place to set up the radar. together to have two international airports within yeah, five yeah, kilometers yeah. mate you're gonna the planes will be flying over your house every day or man you know uh, yeah you'll go mental mate but from business yeah no I agree man you just wake up get out of bed hop in your car and at the airport and then shoo, 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 shoo. Yeah. So 
say that I had about three clients and that's it. Mm. Don't want to bother that much. Yeah. kilometers and kilometers of trucks here trying to get to the border as well luckily as cars you can um, you can always go around the side but wow Exciting days travel though. Let's see what happens. I don't know, man. This is a good, it's not a good sign so far. Will be. It's not that far. Just going to cross the. Uh, Passport 
this is not a it's not a um, full uh -huh. it's not a full card I was thinking I'd get exactly like that but no it's just the permanent residence mate it's not a passport Stop. So getting the full border crossing experience at Rusia today, unedited, uncut. <laughs> all the trucks, all the cars. Yeah, it's actually looking a little bit busy, I think. Or well, maybe it's one lane now. guys so the traffic uh, here at the border has just suddenly turned bumper to bumper which is not good so I think Russo would be pretty middle of the week shouldn't be too bad and you can see people have, people have jumped out of their cars this is always happens here people jump out have a smoke so Luchon's about to walk in front of the camera there's Luchon having his smoke He's going to have a look for somewhere to have a pee. Yeah. I 
wasn't expecting this today on a Wednesday. Now, and I'll pick up again because I want to let everyone get the whole border crossing experience. Um, that's the beauty of having a camera mounted here. People don't question them anymore because they just think they're a, they're a car cam, you know, recording for accidents and that. Um, whereas if you have something in your hand going through a border crossing, you're still going to get people say, no cameras, stop recording, because most of them you're not allowed to, obviously. All right. <laughs> 